This movie is based on Jennifer E. Smith's young adult novel of the same name. It tells a story about Aiden and Claire, a teen couple who decide that dating each other when college is just around the corner would be pointless, so they agree to stay together for 10 months and then break up. First of all, this movie has a basic weakness, which is the premise. It's almost impossible to preemptively choosing an end date for your relationship. Love is an unstoppable and uncontrollable force, and anyone at any age knows this, even if the protagonists do not. Would real people, never mind teenagers, remotely act this way? We highly doubt it. This premise also creates a narrative dead end as it fails to solve basic problems dealing with narrative credulity and the outcome's predictability. From the moment the two set the pack, there are only two ways the film could end, tragic and unfulfilling, or heartwarming and satisfying. The script and the on-the-nose direction do not leave space for anything in between. The material doesn't do much to subvert our expectations, nor surprise us when the inevitable twists occur. While the premise is quite unique, there's no way anyone could sit down and not predict how the thing is going to play out. From the start, Aiden is dead set on getting Claire back at whatever cost, and his personality indicates that the movie will give him his fairy tale ending. Likewise, Claire's soft and guarded nature is absolutely begging to be broken down by the right guy. The script doesn't make the main character's reasoning sound viable, and it doesn't give them the necessary breathing room to find their endings on their own. There's only so much this narrative can do to keep the audience engaged as the conflict feels forced and obtuse. There is no intense magnetic connection that could help solidify why this relationship could or should last beyond high school. The cute and cheesy dialogue cannot make it feel natural or authentic. The emotional peaks feel unearned as audiences don't have the full extent of this relationship to fall back on. This frustratingly predictable narrative is one that perhaps is best engaged in the novel because the film adaptation cannot fully explore the sentimental moments that make up the couple's final date. There is very little to enjoy to that end as it's disappointingly hollow and needs a firm foundation. Overall, this movie really shows the dreadfully boring core of the overall story. The issues the movie attempts to tackle, like parental expectations, heartbreak, anxiety over choosing the right path, have all been addressed better in other films. We do not recommend this movie at all.